done my in the wet hair, but I don't think I've actually talked to the vlog yet, even though I've been vlogging since I woke up at 8.30. It is now almost 2 p.m. <laughs> I woke up this morning, had breakfast and my coffee, and then went to the gym. Now I'm showered and ready, and we're gonna be going and picking up some friends from the airport. Hey guys, so we just got back from Milwaukee. Pretty sure I haven't updated you since I literally set the camera down on the bed where it is right now. But later tonight I am watching a movie at my friend's apartment, which fun fact is actually upstairs. So James and I own a duplex and we rent an apartment that's upstairs. It's like its own entrance apartment to, to one of our friends. So I'm going to be watching a movie up there with her and another friend. I'm going to try to be productive until said movie because I have not done anything around the house today and I just noticed if I do like even just a little bit around the house every day, it leads to less work for me one of the days I have to clean. So I think we're going to do some laundry and whatever. So yeah. Okay, so now we're in my office and I just folded all those clothes like you saw. Now I'm going to be putting away all these clothes. These are all clean clothes that have been piling up in this chair. So I'm going to hang them all up. And then these are clothes that I need to fold and then those are clothes to donate. So I'm gonna get those in a bag so that I can take them and donate them, yay. Okay, so I finished putting all the clothes away, except for the ones that are like need to be folded and put away. But all of my hanging clothes are up. I still need to go through them, I think, one more time and get rid of some more clothes. But my friends are here and ready to watch the movie. So we're gonna go do that and I'm probably gonna bullet journal. <laughs> Good morning guys, Sunday morning. I made some egg bake. It's in the oven right now, but I'm getting ready. I didn't show me making it because I've tried to film me like making stuff before in the kitchen and it just never seems to work right. So I didn't try, but maybe later if that's something you guys want to see. But I'm gonna go ahead and get ready now for church. I'm not gonna show me doing makeup because I did yesterday, so I don't wanna do that twice. Hey guys, haven't updated you since I got ready this morning, but obviously it is now later, it is 3 p.m. I went to a bar class for the first time. So my opinions on bar, not that you asked, but just to let you know, Valley has to look out the window apparently. It was really good, it was mostly like Pilates sort of kind of, mixed with like ballet moves i guess you would say but it was good it was a really good workout clearly then i went to the grocery store and now i'm home i'm gonna eat lunch so i'll show you guys what i'm having i made it before i left and then i didn't have time to eat it so it looks kind of interesting but it is buffalo chicken with cauliflower rice a little bit of ranch and broccoli there was a lot more broccoli but i ate that really fast before i left 
but I didn't want to eat all of this buffalo chicken before I went to a workout because I thought that might not be the best idea ever. So yeah, I'm gonna eat this and then I'm probably going to take a nap. Because it's Sunday, what else do you do on Sunday? It's time for a nap. Yeah. As you're making a nice, healthy, delicious dinner. So this is cauliflower gnocchi and then Trader Joe's brand new kale gnocchi. Haven't tried it yet, but we're gonna make this in a sheet pan. You can go ahead and put that in there. We're adding onion and this is like three cheese Italian sausages cut into um, coins. We're gonna add some minced garlic. We're gonna add some crushed red pepper, garlic powder, two cans of diced tomatoes and one can of tomato paste to make it a little thicker. And we're gonna make our own like kind of spaghetti sauce and it's gonna go over this cauliflower and kale gnocchi. Yummy. Hello everyone. Today was gonna be really productive and I wanted to just get a lot done. Um, I just wasn't able to get as much done yesterday. So I wanted to, but <laughs> being completely honest, I'm just really tired and I've done a lot this weekend, so we're going to take the rest of the night off and start our Monday fresh with new productivity. I think we're going to eat some ice cream, possibly watch some Grey's Anatomy, and I think that's probably it. <laughs> just going to have a chill night in. Okay, so I just wanted to show, share with you guys something if you have not heard of it. I am 100% sure you probably have because everyone has. But <laughs> we are currently trying to work on our health and whatever. <laughs> so basically, um, we love Halo Top. It's a light ice cream. Um, this is James flavor. It's blueberry crumble. We both really liked it. And then I went ahead and got peanut butter and jelly, which I know sounds really weird. I like weird things. But if you ate this whole thing, it would only be 360 calories. But if you eat about a fourth of it, yeah. So like a fourth of the container, it's only 90 calories and only 16 grams of carbs. But most of the carbs are sugar, alcohol, and fiber. So they're like not necessarily bad carbs. <laughs> So if you're keto, these are really good. We're not keto, but we are trying some low carb. So these are amazing if you have a hundred of them. They always come out with new flavors. So I just wanted to show you that. And I'll let you know what I think about peanut butter and jelly. Okay, so this is really weird, but I'm not a huge packaging person. I guess it's not really weird. But I think it's cool they have like gold foil because it always makes me think of Willy Wonka and the chocolate factory, you know, like if you have the gold ticket. Yeah, so. Gold foil, I'll show you guys. Usually you wanna set your halo top on the counter for a little bit. I'm acting like this is sponsored, but it's not, obviously. Um, so it like gets a little bit more like the actual consistency of ice cream. So let's try it. Oh wow. It is very good. It actually tastes like peanut butter and jelly in ice cream form. Hi, it's Future Casey editing this vlog and realizing some of the stupid stuff I say. Like, <laughs> I'm pretty sure peanut butter and jelly ice cream would taste like peanut butter and jelly in ice cream form. Also, I never finished this vlog off, but yeah, we, we did watch Grey's Anatomy, and then we went to bed. Um, so, that's the end of the vlog. Thank you for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. Should be coming out later this week. Um, it's gonna be a video where I surprised James all the way back in December. I had two videos I filmed in December that were supposed to be part of Vlogmas, but if you look on my channel, it's clear how Vlogmas ended it just kind of stopped um but i had a baking video but like i lost half of the footage for it so my friend emily and i baked like all these cookies and it was this magnificent marvelous thing and i lost half of the footage so i can't use that one but i did surprise james with a nice big surprise so that will be my next video look forward to it